just crazy. Uh, to have my time wrapping up in uh, D.C. to getting the family, you know, packed up, getting ready to have them ship out here to L.A. Um, and then, you know, just emotions of joining the Dodgers. And I think the best part is I get to join with Trey. Uh, you know, I have him coming over and uh, to walk into the clubhouse. And then first person I see is Albert Pujols and giving him a big hug. So, uh, you know, I face these guys over the years. Uh, but it's now fun to, you know, put on the blue. And, uh, you know, now we're teammates. And, uh, you know, let's go. And when you saw that the Dodgers were a team that you could be traded to, what went through your head as what the opportunity could be like and what you guys can do here? Yeah, uh, obviously, you know, Dodgers are a great team. Uh, knew that coming into the deadline. Uh, obviously, this is a you know organization I want you know would like to be a part of. Um, and so when the trade happened, uh, you know, I got the call from Mike Rizzo saying that you wanted to trade me to the Dodgers. I said, let's do it. Let's go. Um, and so, you know, obviously we know it's at stake. Uh, obviously the team won the World Series last year. Um, but, I mean, it's really difficult to, re- you know, the repeat, especially in this season with the 162. You know, there's so many so many things that can happen over this course of the season that uh, as good as this team is right now, uh, it's going to take a heck of an effort uh, to have a good postseason as well. So, um, you know, it, you know, frankly, look at the division. I mean, you're not even first place, so you got to realize there's a lot of work in front of us. And so just glad to be a part of this uh, and know how much work's in front. And you mentioned Albert's hug, which I have been told is something very special, especially when the guys come around after a home run. But how has it been just getting to know some of the other guys in the clubhouse so far? Yeah, I've, I've known him kind of throughout the years. You know, you know, have have some friendships, uh, especially with Kershaw. You know, we've had that, you know, a lot of different uh, talks over things over the years. Uh, so it, it's it's fun to um, you know this this is what the baseball game you know in my, in my career uh, you know brings about is that you know I've looked you know I had great times in Arizona, Detroit, and Washington. Now I have a new chapter, and uh, you know I get some new new teammates and. Uh, you know, puts a little spice in your life when you have to change your uniform uh, and, you know, with some new teammates and get to know these guys. And, uh, you know, it should be fun. And we saw yesterday in the dugout you were talking with Walker Buehler as well as Clayton Kershaw. Can you just give us a little information on what that conversation was like? <laughs> uh, just think, just normal big league stuff. Um, what's going on in the plane flights? You know, just, just more more off the field stuff. I, I, I don't, we weren't really talking pitching. I'll say that. <laughs> And obviously now the plan is for on Wednesday that you'll be making the start, making your Dodger debut at Dodger Stadium against the Astros. What are you looking forward to about that opera, this about that matchup? I mean, we all know the history, but you know, for me that for that to be my first experience here, like that's gonna be nuts. Um, you know, it's I mean, I I don't even know what that atmosphere is gonna be like. Um, so. Uh, it's going to be crazy. This whole experience is crazy being traded midseason. So enjoy it. Keep a smile on your face and go out there and compete and try to win. Thank you so much, Max. I know we are all looking forward to seeing you out there. Appreciate it. Thank you.